Hello students, I am Rajvinder Kaur, English Mistress from GMS Rurki Kala, District SBS Nagar. Today we are going to complete yet another lesson from your reader book that is Lesson 3, Budgeting Year Time. This lesson is going to be two lessons. असी इस लेसन दा पहला पार्ट कंप्लीट करेंगे। So, before we start, let me ask you one question. What expensive things do you own? थोड़ी को बहुत सारी हैं कीमती चीज़ें हों कि हैं। सोचो कि उन्हें देखें जो तो हमें सब तो ज़्यादा कीमती केरी चीज़ लगती है। Many of you might say it's gold, a big house, gadgets, latest phones, car, or your bike. Yes, of course. These things are really expensive. And now, one more question. What is more precious than these? Tadi khayal de vich ina chizon to bhi zyada ki kimti hai. Socho zara. Yes, it is time. Time is more precious than anything else. Sama सब तो ज़्यादा कीमती चीज़ है। दुनिया दी किसे भी कीमती चीज़ तो वाद कीमती। And this is what this lesson is all about। अगले लेसन दे भी चापा समय दे बारे ही पढ़ांगे। Now let's read the text। Money they say is the most important thing in life. Money makes the mayor go is an age-old saying. The power of money, people believe, is great. But greater still is the power of time. Money, once lost, can be regained. Time, once lost, is lost forever. Time and tide wait for none. If you do not make the best use of time and do not take time by the forelock, you are destined to be doomed. Shakespeare the drawing of English literature wrote, There is a tide in the affairs of men, which, taken at the flood, leads on to fortune. Omitted all the voyage of their life, is bound in shallows and in Miseries. During the tough course of the journey of life, rarely comes the time which can make or mar a person's whole future. Such a precious moment must not be allowed to go unnoticed. One must act in time before it's too late. This can be possible only if we are alive and alert to the importance of every single second in our lives. Those who waste time and let it pass unnoticed have to repent 
and pine only when there is no remedy. Every second in life is important. Seconds add up to minutes, hours, days and months. Many a trickle makes a mickle. Why not then save every second to make the best use of time? If you do not do that, a lot of time is squandered down the drain for nothing. Life is short and uncertain. Now, let's learn some new words from the text we have just read. The first one is Money makes the mare go. It is an idiom which means that at many places money can make the things happen. Punjabi ch jinu ke ha janda hai daam banai kaam. Yani paise de naal kaam swari ja sakte ne. The second one is Take time by the forelock. Forelock hair is the hair growing over the forehead. Mathiviti samni wali wal, those are called as forelock. As a whole, uh, its meaning is make the best use of time. Yani samida. Jinna vi vadiya sab to changa upyoga si kar sakte hain o karna. The next word is destined. Its meaning be intended for a particular purpose. Next is doomed. Its meaning is something which is fated to fail. A जिते बारे ये पक्के ऐसे कहते हैं कि कोई चीज़ है जिन्हें असफल ही होना होता है। Next word is tide. Tide is a high wave in seas. But here in this lesson, it means a certain good opportunity. And the last one is doing. Doing is the senior member of a body, class, or a profession. Punjabi chakpa jayin kya sakti hai ki kisi vi chiz da baba board. Like Shakespeare, he is the doin of literature, yani sahit da baba board. Now, let me explain the first part of the text for you. The writer has started with stating the importance of money. So, sab to pehli alliance te vich asin cha changi tarah dekhi, ta unna de vich paise di importance de baare ta siya hai ki kis tarah baut saare kaam jade ya, oho paise di taakat te badalut ho saakte ne. Par nali jada writer hai, he says that compared to time, the money is less powerful. Kyunki, agar पैसा एक बारी चला जाए तो उन्हें दोबारा कमाया जा सकता है पर समा या टाइम एक बारी साड़ी हथों निकल जावे तो वो दोबारा साड़ी को नहीं आता एक बारी जरा समा बीत गया वो साड़ी को लोग गुआच जाता है और the people who do not make the best use of time they will definitely fail उना दा असफल होना तय हो जाता है जो समय दी कदर नहीं कर दी समा भी उना दी कदर करता है जो समय दी कदर कर दी नहीं समय नो अजाइंग वाण वाले लोग कदी ही जिंदगी च सफल नहीं हो सकते and the writer emphasizes the same through the lines written by Shakespeare in his play Julius Caesar 
ਜਿਹੜੀਆਂ ਨੀਚੇ ਚਾਰ ਲਾਈਨਸ ਇਹ ਦਿੱਤੀਆਂ ਆਂ ਸ਼ੇਕਸਪੀਅਰ ਦੇ ਇੱਕ ਪਲੇ ਜੂਲੀਅਸ ਸੀਜ਼ਰ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚੋਂ ਲਈਆਂ ਹੈ ਔਰ ਇਹਨਾਂ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਵੀ ਸੇਮ ਉਹੀ ਗੱਲ ਜਿਹੜੀ ਹੈ ਉਹ ਕਹੀ ਗਈ ਹੈ ਕਿ ਸਮੇਂ ਦਾ ਹਮੇਸ਼ਾ ਸਦਉਪਯੋਗ ਕਰਨਾ ਚਾਹੀਦਾ ਹੈ ਔਰ ਕਦੀ ਵੀ ਇਹਨੂੰ ਵੈਸੇ ਹੀ ਗਵਾਉਣਾ ਨਹੀਂ ਚਾਹੀਦਾ let's move forward with more new words the first word is repent it means to feel sorry for something after it is gone yani pachtava pachtava karna the next word is pine meaning crying in grief dukh de vich rona the next is remedy remedy means medicine or solution to some problem yani kisi bhi mushkil da hal the next one is a saying many a trickle makes a mickle it means that if we collect small amounts of something it can make a big amount ਜਿਹਨੂੰ ਆਪਾਂ ਪੰਜਾਬੀ ਚ ਅਗਰ ਕਹੀਏ ਤਾਂ ਬੂੰਦ ਬੂੰਦ ਦੇ ਨਾਲ ਸਾਗਰ ਭਰ ਜਾਂਦਾ ਹੈ ਐਂਡ ਦ ਲਾਸਟ ਵਰਡ ਇਜ਼ ਸਕੁਆਂਡਰਡ ਸਕੁਆਂਡਰਡ ਮੀਨਸ ਵੇਸਟਡ ਯਾਨੀ ਕਿਸੇ ਚੀਜ਼ ਨੂੰ ਜ਼ਾਇਆ ਕਰ ਦੇਣਾ ਗਵਾ ਦੇਣਾ ਨਾ ਆਮ ਕੰਟੀਨਿਊਇੰਗ ਓਵਰ ਦ ਐਕਸਪਲੇਨੇਸ਼ਨ ਆਫ ਦ ਟੈਕਸਟ ਹੀਅਰ ਇਨ ਥੀਸ ਲਾਈਨਸ the writer emphasizes the importance of opportunity yani zindagi de vich mauka ki importance rakhta hai the right opportunities come rarely in life and one cannot afford to miss them yani assi gwa nahi sakde koi bhi mauka kyunki zindagi sanu baar baar mauka nahi dindi because these opportunities are the very base of one's future the people who waste time fail drastically and cry later on as nothing can be done afterwards kyunki sama agar assi ik wari gwa diye ta oh dobara sade hath nahi aunda is liye zaruri hai ki assi ਇੱਕ ਇੱਕ ਸੈਕਿੰਡ ਨੂੰ ਬਚਾਈਏ ਆਪਣਾ ਕੋਈ ਵੀ ਇੱਕ ਪਲ ਵੀ ਜ਼ਿੰਦਗੀ ਦਾ ਅਸੀਂ ਵੇਸਟ ਨਾ ਕਰੀਏ ਬਿਕਾਜ਼ ਸੈਕਿੰਡਸ ਐਡ ਅਪ ਟੂ ਮਿਨਟਸ ਮਿਨਟਸ ਟੂ ਆਵਰਸ ਆਵਰਸ ਟੂ ਡੇਜ਼ ਐਂਡ ਡੇਜ਼ ਟੂ ਮੰਥਸ ਯਾਨੀ ਬੂੰਦ ਬੂੰਦ ਦੇ ਨਾਲ ਸਾਗਰ ਭਰਦਾ ਹੈ ਛੋਟੇ ਛੋਟੀਆਂ ਮੂਮੈਂਟਸ ਨੂੰ ਅਗਰ ਅਸੀਂ ਸੰਭਾਲ ਕੇ ਰੱਖੀਏ ਤਾਂ ਸਾਨੂੰ ਵੱਡੇ ਵੱਡੇ ਮੌਕੇ ਦੇ ਦਿੰਦੀਆਂ ਹਨ ਵੀ ਮਸਟ ਨੋਟ ਵੇਸਟ ਈਵਨ ਅ ਸੈਕਿੰਡ ਬਿਕਾਜ਼ ਲਾਈਫ ਇਜ਼ ਅਨਸਰਟੇਨ ਸਾਨੂੰ ਨਹੀਂ ਪਤਾ ਕਿ ਜ਼ਿੰਦਗੀ ਦਾ ਕਿਹੜਾ ਪਲ ਆਖਰੀ ਹੋਏਗਾ ਜ਼ਿੰਦਗੀ ਕਦੇ ਵੀ ਖਤਮ ਹੋ ਸਕਦੀ ਹੈ ਇਸ ਲਈ ਹਮੇਸ਼ਾ ਹਰ ਮੌਕੇ ਨੂੰ ਤੇ ਹਰ ਪਲ ਨੂੰ ਸੰਭਾਲਣਾ ਸਾਡੀ ਡਿਊਟੀ ਹੈ ਸੋ ਸਟੂਡੈਂਟਸ ਲੈਟਸ ਨਾਓ ਟਿਕਲ ਯੂਰ ਬ੍ਰੇਨਸ ਵਿਦ ਥਿਸ ਵੋਕੈਬਲਰੀ ਐਕਸਰਸਾਈਜ਼ ਯੂ ਹੈਵ ਟੂ ਮੈਚ ਦ ਵਰਡਸ ਇਨ ਕੋਲਮ A ਵਿਦ ਦੇਅਰ ਸਿਨੋਨਿਮਸ ਇਨ ਕੋਲਮ B ਕੋਲਮ A ਦੇ ਵਰਡਸ ਕੋਲਮ B ਦੇ ਵਰਡਸ ਵਿਦ ਨਾਲ synonyms are or unnu no, tusi match karna hai so grab your notebooks and write your answers while i read these words for you in column a the words are wealth significant wasted and tough and in column b the words are squandered money hard important i'm pretty sure that you people are ready with your answers 
and here are the answers wealth is matched with money significant is important wasted squandered and tough hard but surely this exercise was not that hard for you enjoying let's do one more exercise it is also a matching exercise you have to match words in column a with their meanings in column b so let me read these words in column a are the words believe hold trickle and point and in column b are the words to feel sad or distressed to flow in drops complete and to have faith i'm convinced that you can do this exercise very easily and after looking at the answers you people must be feeling the same now let me read out the answers in column a the believe is matched with to have faith whole complete trickle to flow in drops and pine to feel sad or distressed so students let's now tickle your brains with this vocabulary exercise you have to match the words in column a with their synonyms in column b column a the words column b the words with naal synonyms are aur unhe hum tusi match kar rahe hain so grab your notebooks and write your answers while i read these words for you in column a the words are wealth significant wasted and tough and in column b the words are squandered money hard important i'm pretty sure that you people are ready with your answers and here are the answers wealth is matched with money significant is important wasted squandered and tough hard but surely this exercise was not that hard for you enjoying let's do one more exercise it is also a matching exercise you have to match words in column a with their meanings in column b so let me read these words in column a are the words believe hold trickle and point and in column b are the words to feel sad or distressed to flow in drops complete and to have faith i'm convinced that you can do this exercise very easily and after looking at the answers you people must be feeling the same now let me read out the answers in column a 
the belief is matched with to have faith whole complete trickle to flow in drops and pine to feel sad or distressed after the vocabulary exercises let us do a couple of grammar exercises change the voice of the following sentences the first sentence the boy ate the mango second i do not know him third your conduct surprised me fourth this pot contains milk fifth your actions annoyed him sixth we should help the poor seventh the police has arrested the thief and the last he has finished his work now let's match the answers the boy ate the mango changes to the mango was eaten by the boy i do not know him changes to he is not known to me your conduct surprises me changed to i am surprised by your conduct this pot contains milk changes to milk is contained in this pot your actions annoyed him changes to he was annoyed by your actions we should help the poor changes to the poor should be helped by us the police has arrested the thief changes to the thief has been arrested by the police in the last sentence he has finished his work changes to his work has been finished i'm pretty sure that you got all the answers right let's do one more exercise fill in these blanks with suitable articles the first one is she has dash beautiful look second dash sun rises in dash east third i read dash tribune daily fourth he is dash honest person fifth i need dash new uniform sixth haridwar is dash holy place seventh iron is dash useful metal eighth it is raining hard i need dash umbrella and now let's match the answers she has a beautiful look the sun rises in the east i read the tribune daily he is an honest person i need a new uniform haridwar is a holy place iron is a useful metal and the last one it is raining i need an umbrella here is one more brain teaser for you give one word 
फॉर ईच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग बच्चे ये फ्रेजिज दिखाई हुई हैं जिन्होंने लिए तुम एक एक सिंगल वर्ड देना है नाउ आई एम रीडिंग देम वन बाय वन वन हु नेवर डांस वन हु बिलीव्स इन गॉड वन हु इज प्रेजेंट एवरीवेयर गवर्नमेंट by the people and the last is one who makes gold ornaments think about the answers i have no doubt that they are quite easy for you aur answers dekhne ke baad tonu bhi yahi lag raha hai na ki bahut sokhi si let's match the answers one who never dies is immortal one who believes in god is called atheist one who is present everywhere is called omnipresent the government by the people is called democracy and one who makes gold ornaments is called a goldsmith and students now it's time for homework you have to answer these questions after reading the text pyare bachcho ye sare questions tuhanu texts de unne hisse de vichon hi mil jange jinna assi aaj cover kita hai so the first question is why is money considered so important second is what do people believe about power of money third is does time wait for anyone and the last is what type of precious moment should not be lost and with this we come to the end of today's session thank you for your patient and attentive listening i hope that today's session was enjoyable and the part we have covered today is clear to you thank you once again